Hello, Langlings, English students from around the world. Oh, look, it's a hot air balloon. And there is Mr. P. And what's he doing? Flying to America. Today, we're going to learn about travel vocabulary in English. Oh, yes, we are. That's going to be great fun. Don't forget your sunglasses, Mr. P. Let's go to America. Meow. So, first of all, tourist attraction. What is a tourist attraction? Something like the Statue of Liberty. A important destination for tourists. Or maybe the Eiffel Tower in Paris. A reservation. You might need this when you're going to a restaurant or a hotel when you're traveling. Like when Mr. P visits this American cake shop. Native country, homeland. This is when you tell the people in America where you're from. Mr. P would say, meow, 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 or I'm from Scotland. Oh, yes, he would. And wonder. Wonder is a really lovely word to use. It means you walk around with no goal, just enjoying the landscape, the woods in this case. Case. Mr. P is loving it. Luggage. You'll need this if you want to go to America. Pack your bags, take your clothes. Exchange money. Also important. Maybe Mr. P only has pounds and he needs dollars. So he has to exchange his money so that he has money to pay with. Last of all, recommend. It's when you tell your friend something. So maybe Zuzu the cat might tell Mr. P something like where to go on holiday, a recommendation. Meow, meow, meow. She says, I think next time you should go to Germany. Okay, this has been great travel vocabulary. This has been Learn English with Charles, your language tutor online. I recommend you subscribe to this great channel. Please leave a comment below. Maybe use these words and make a sentence. See you soon.